Master Chief premium format is here after several months of delays. It's nearly a year. Was it February or March? He was meant to ship and we kept getting delays, delays and delays. It's been quite a ride uh, in the thread, I must say. I have enjoyed it, chatting with all those guys in there uh, at Sideshow Freaks. It's been great fun chatting with you all guys and um, the dramas of when he first shipped, those first picks were so good and um, the haters piled on and then when uh, we got some more picks we started to see that he was in fact a beast of enormous magnitude and that people were very very happy with him. I can say I got mine today at work. He finally came after a little uh, holiday he had in Honolulu. Uh, he didn't fit on the flight he was meant to be on from uh, from Honolulu with FedEx. They bumped him and um, he came a few days late. So he came today finally after his little Honolulu holiday and uh, I have had him out and I love it. Let's have a good look at the Halo uh, Master Chief premium format. It is, of course, from, um, from the Combat Evolved Anniversary Edition, the HD update that they did uh, last year, was it? Or the year before they put it out. Um, so, you know, he's not perhaps exactly as, uh, as he appeared in the first game. He's sort of as he appeared, perhaps how Bungie would like to have had him look for that first game. Um, but let's have a bit of a better look at him. Um, and, you know, if you skipped this big when he came out, you were caught napping because it was only a 300 uh, edition size. And the X got snapped up. It's the X here today with the Needler. Let's have a look at him, YouTube. There he is. Oh my goodness, look, I can even record myself recording myself in his visor. Oh. Didn't he come out beautifully? If we go back there, it's a sweet spot there. You can see a lot of the scuff marks on the edges, especially around the edges and the points of his eye. If we go in a little bit, make sure well, we keep the focus. Scuff marks all over top of the AR. You can see his mesh sort of undersuit under his armour there I guess. He's a pretty big guy, the Chief. Scroll down, we've got more scuff marks, blast marks on his knees and his shins. Let's have a look at the back. More explosions, sulphur, Marks, scuff marks on the back of the armor. There's dead ass. And yeah, still nicely detailed and nicely painted armor. Highlighting a bit of differences there where his ankle's exposed. You can see his mesh sort of undersuit that you get in spots like that. And um, at the back there. Down to the base. Oh, the base isn't amazing, you know. But um, it's big. It suits the environment, you know, that uh, the chief charges around in. And he just looks epic standing on it. Let's have a look at some of the switch outs. Okay guys, let's have a quick look at the accessories he comes with. Some pretty elaborate instructions. Um, I guess the last piece, maybe the last premium format I got was was Dutch up there. He came with some instructions because he's got a few elements to him. Um, but the last couple of things I got were Batman and Superman up there. There's no, there's nothing really to do for them. Um, so some instructions there, a couple of pages uh, of how to change out his arms and his weapons, and I've got them sitting just there. That's the 
X Needler and that Magnum. Okay, there he is with the Needler. I don't know, people in the thread are saying, oh, what do you, what do you need the Needler for? As if you use the Needler. As if you didn't use the fucking Needler, man. It homes in on people, it laces them, and they fucking explode. It is a guaranteed kill in multi. Um, and I use it all the time. If it's lying there, I'll pick it up. Shit, I don't care. I'll get a kill. And I hope I piss you off when I use it, because I'm going to laugh at you when you explode in pink mist. It is a very nice little X. You can see a sort of a pattern there. Just make it out on the phone camera there. And the needles are very nice. Sort of translucent look to them. And just suits the chief. Look at him. Excellent exclusive there. Okay, and finally the Magnum. The way they've worked it with the pose, it looks like he has just slapped in a new magazine, which is very cool. Again, scuff marks, lots of wear and tear on the Magnum, which makes it look authentic. And he's just about to turn around and pop some caps. How good was this gun in the first multi? I played so much of that multi at land parties. Oh, great days. You know you played a lot of multi when you go to sleep and you're still here. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, what a great piece. Definitely one of Sideshow's best. And well worth the wait. This was over there. Interesting. This is the first time for me that um, there was two shippers. So I imagine that contributed, I don't know. It's quite a big ship. The outer box is quite big. And it's a little bit of a skinnier box. And then it's the art box that you see back there. But that would have contributed, I don't know, probably an extra for me. Shipping wasn't cheap. It was over a hundred bucks. Um, yeah, probably knocked it up another Forty bucks, at least, for that. There he is, the Master Chief uh, from Halo Combat Evolved, the anniversary. But we all know it's original Chief. It's the OG Chief, my favourite iteration of the suit. Some people like Halo Three, Halo Four, whatever. It's OG Chief for me. He's big, he's beefy, he's clunky, and he looks fantastic. I'm not sure where I'm going to put him yet on the shelves. Uh, one thing I have noticed with the switch out weapons, especially these little uh, pistol versions, the Magnum and the Needler. Be careful popping them in, I have to give them a bit of a jiggle to get them all the way in. So be careful with that. But he looks fantastic. Definitely figure of the year for me, being the, it's the only one that I've got this year. Uh, the other things I got this year were busts. So, absolutely love him. Well worth the wait. Good uh, enjoying the journey all the way through the thread with you guys and uh, thanks for watching and I will catch you on the next vid that will be the Batman premium format figure if it ever ships it's meant to come in January hopefully that's when it comes thanks guys and I'll see you on the next vid